Saint Spencer at the Maker Fair Africa 2009 in Accra, Ghana. Today, we are celebrating African ingenuity, innovation, and invention. Makers from all over Africa are here to showcase their work. This is a really special event. Uh, there's not really anything like this. People who invent and create need encouragement and support. Often they're considered a little bit mad by their environment. Um, and having these people together who take their time to roll up their sleeves, make it happen, try things out, meet each other. They're not only sharing knowledge and skills and, and tips, they're getting the inspiration and the encouragement of people in the same mind space as them. The computer industry in the U.S. is one a great example that we use here. It started from computer clubs and, and uh, computer fairs in, uh, in California and places like that. That these guys came together, these geeks, and, and out of that became, you know, the Steve Jobs and the Bill Gates of the world. So let's uh, let's see what we can do around that in, in, in Africa. That same ideology of mashing people together, mashing ideas together. Some some are doing agriculture. Some are doing uh, creating software for Android-enabled phones. Hey, what happens when you put those two guys together? This is the cream. I take only two ladders. And this is the activator. I use this one to start the heating. So, aluminum chips and aluminum powder. I made them myself. Okay? Now I'm going to stir it and the heat will begin in five minutes' time. It's very hot inside. And I'm using this to preserve my food. When I put food inside us, okay, 24 hours, it will be warm. And the electric cream is down here. This is generating the heat down here. It's called a talking book device, a low-cost multimedia application that makes knowledge accessible to rural dwellers. It's, it's um, a multimedia application that has a user-friendly interface and has an audio, an audio manual that allows rural dwellers that have no, no education and are poor and are mostly subsistence farmers to learn literacy from these devices. One of the fundamental things about invention is that people invent to solve their problems. I believe that I have what it takes to change my world and, and to change opinion and I, and I challenge people what people think and believe through photography. You know, People don't care really about the environment until they see what they are losing. And that is what I love about photography, that it is a weapon in the hands of a man on a mission. As an inaugural event, uh, we were not absolutely certain as to how things would pan out, but we are fairly happy and satisfied with a number of things, the turnout, the fact that we have a wide range of makers ranging from people in the arts to robotics, through metalwork, through textiles, fashion, design. Uh, the range of areas has been as broad as we would love it to be. Uh, the discussions that are taking place have been very satisfactory. Uh, I think we can say that we started the process of um, planting the seeds and hopefully doing what we can to foster uh, this e ecosystem of creativity that we think is essential uh, for the continent's growth. And Ghana has been a good launching pad for us. Mm -hmm.